Now, Los Angeles Apparel is one of the most recognized brands out there in the market today that is being used by one of the most popular brands, and that brand is Unfinished Legacy. If you creators are not aware of Unfinished Legacy, make sure to go and check them out. Now, with that being said, we're going to put these t-shirts to the test to see if they're worth it or not. Now, the first category we're going to get into is pricing. Now, these shirts come in 16 different colorways that you can choose from from this website. And as you can see, these shirts are priced at $29 retail and $10.95 wholesale. Also, if you're looking to pay in four interest-free payments, they have Sezzle and Shop Pay available on this website. Now, if you creators do not have a wholesale license, I do recommend you try to get yourselves one so you will be able to purchase these shirts at their lowest price available from their wholesale section. Now, the second category we're going to get into is sizing. Now, this is the 1807 six and a half ounce long sleeve garment dye crew neck t-shirt. Now, as you can see, I'm wearing an extra large of both the black and white colorway. These shirts run from sizes extra small all the way to 2XL. Now, these shirts are true to size, so if your customers are looking for more of an oversized look, I do recommend you inform them to size up now the third category we're going to get into is printing now in these shirts i decided to go with two different methods screen printing and heat transfers so the heat transfers i'm going to go with is caesar brick so for both of these shirts i pressed at 311 degrees at a 15 second press with a cold peel but first you want to start with a five second press on a regular side but after that you want to flip the shirt inside out and press for the full 15 seconds to get a nice clean press so that way the print will last through each wash and for the screen printing method i went with ecotex white plastisol ink now if you're like me and you do not have a flash dryer, you can use your heat press machine at 375 degrees at a 30 second press. And also if you're looking for an easier and inexpensive way to screen print, I'll leave a link down below in the description for transferexpress.com. Now what I like about the Caesar brick, it gives off that essentials fear guard look on your garments. So if your creators are interested in using the Caesar brick, I will leave a link down below in the description. Now the fourth category we're gonna get into is washing. Now both of these shirts came out just the same after the wash little to no shrinkage no wrinkles when it comes to the collar and no fading when it pertains to the black colorway also a lot of times when you wash a white t-shirt you might see some dullness when it comes to that shirt but when it pertains to this long sleeve shirt there was no dullness whatsoever also both prints held up on the shirt as well when it pertains to the screen print on the back of the shirt and also the heat transfer vinyl in the front of the shirt and when it pertains to screen printing, if you're screen printing at home and you do not have a flash dryer, you can use your heat press machine at 375 degrees at a 30 second press to make sure you cure that ink so after every wash, there will be no flaking and no peeling whatsoever when your customers are washing their shirts. Now the fifth category we're gonna get into is quality. Now for product softness, these t-shirts are between very soft and average. These t-shirts are more on the rougher side. They're not that soft but they're very comfortable on the body. For material quality, now these t-shirts are garment dye tees, which are washed with natural enzymes that gives off that broken in feel. So these t-shirts do have more of that vintage feel to them. So if you're looking to use vintage style t-shirts within your streetwear brand, merch line or t-shirt side hustle, I would recommend using these tees for that style as well. For product durability, these t-shirts are between excellent and as expected. Now these t-shirts are very durable in my opinion, especially after the wash, both of the images on these t-shirts held up as well. Little to no shrinkage, no wrinkles on the collar, no fade on the black t-shirt the white t-shirt came out just the same as it was before the wash both of these t-shirts are very durable in my opinion now for value of your money now creators if you do have a wholesale license you will be able to get these shirts for a lower price so these shirts are priced at $29 retail and $10.95 wholesale so I do believe these shirts are a great value for your money if you do have a wholesale license so you can prevent paying that $29 retail price within their website and also, once again, if you're looking to pay in full interest-free payments, they have Shop Pay and Sezzle available within their website. Now, what I like to say in all of my videos, it all depends on what type of brand you're looking to create when it comes to looking for the best quality t-shirt for your specific brand. That also goes for sweatshirts, hoodies, sweatpants, jackets, whatever garment that you're looking to use. It all depends on what type of brand that you're working on. So if you are looking for a good quality long sleeve tee for your streetwear brand merch line, or t-shirt side hustle i do recommend the 1807 garmin dye long sleeve t-shirt now i hope you all are gaining some type of
type of value from this content and if you are leave a comment down below now if you're looking to find out my top picks when it comes to this brand click this video right here and also if you're looking to find the best quality t-shirt that fits around whatever brand that you're creating click this video right here